guys, so I just wanted to do an update on Cardano um, and why I'm super bullish on this. Over the next coming days and weeks, I think there's going to be some major upside for this token, guys. Do not sleep on this token. I know that Solana and Luna, tokens like that are going absolutely crazy, but Cardano is not going to get left behind. And why I believe that, many reasons, okay? But first of all, Charles Huskinson is actually doing a AMA tomorrow, 9 p.m., sorry, 9 a.m. PT with Money Talks, okay, hosted by Abra. Now, the last time he did an update, he talked about the smart contracts potentially coming on the 12th of September, which saw the price immediately skyrocket, and we're seeing the, the price kind of hold up strong even still. Okay, guys, but the market's taking a little bit of a dip, but it's nothing to worry about at, at the moment, and that's just my opinion. None of this is financial advice, of course, but um, yeah, I think we're going to see more upside for Cardano. In fact, at the time of recording this video, the price is hovering around $2, between $2.18 and $2.20. So, you know, looks like it's about to break that previous resistance potentially and start heading up to the previous all-time highs, about $2.42, correct me if I'm wrong on that. Okay, guys, but I think the sky's the limit for Cardano because... When the smart contracts actually do land, and we're going to touch on uh, another thing on that as well in a minute, but when the smart contracts do land, it's going to make Cardano skyrocket because there's going to be a lot of Cardano taken out of circulation, okay? Because that Cardano is going to have to be paired up with different projects to provide liquidity um, to allow the ecosystem to thrive, okay? To allow those tokens to kind of, you know, make their name in the space. And um, when we see a lot of Cardano taken out of circulation, that's obviously going to make the price go up. We saw it with Ethereum. We saw it with BNB even more recently. We saw it with Matic, Polygon, okay, guys? And, you know, I don't think we saw it as much with Phantom. <laughs> I would have liked to have seen a little bit of a better performance with Phantom, okay, guys? But Cardano is a different kettle of fish. Cardano is one of the most undervalued, overdeveloped cryptocurrencies in the space at the moment, okay, guys? And I believe, just like I touched on Solana, I believe that Cardano is going to make those same kind of parabolic moves, potentially, okay, guys? Now, Cardano partnerships are increasing, um, literally, Everyone's talking about Cardano, okay? And when everyone's talking about Cardano, the market sentiment is something that you really should follow, okay? You always have to pay attention and kind of go with the trend. The trend is your friend and the trend is Cardano. So a lot more people will come into the market and they will see Cardano and they look at Cardano and they say, well, you know, Cardano is only, what's the price of Cardano at the moment? $2.17 at the time of recording a video, as opposed to Bitcoin being, you know, 40,000 or however much it is, Ethereum 3,000 or however much it is at the moment. So when people, I mean, psychologically, when people process that information, they'll think, well, why would I buy one Bitcoin if I can buy, you know, 20,000, 30,000 Cardano, okay? So it makes sense. It makes sense that Cardano is going to see a lot more adoption. Now, if you look at the market cap, you'll see that, yes, it's in the multiples of the billions. In fact, it's about 60 billion in market cap. Um, but with Ethereum and, you know, a lot, 130 billion, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, Cardano can definitely reach that, can definitely reach that in a very short space of time. And, you know, if, we, if we're talking about going into the trillions, which can happen, I believe, over time, you know, if you're talking about long term, three to five years, um, imagine what the price of Cardano can get to. OK, guys. So I just wanted to do a quick update on that. I've not been well over these past few days, so I haven't made as much content as I would have liked to have made. OK, but I want to do a quick update on Cardano based on the fact that, yes, we could see an astronomical price rise in the very short to mid term. And I think in the very immediate term, if Charles Hoskinson does go on this AMA and start saying things that people like, then it's going to see an immediate price rise at the moment in the build up to the smart contracts. Because some people are talking about buying it, buying the rumor, selling the news and, you know, buy the, buy the test net and sell the main net. Um, but it doesn't necessarily have to happen 
uh, that way where the price actually drops on the day that the smart contracts launch okay because we saw it with ethereum we saw it with bnb um it's we're in the bull run guys so it doesn't have to work that way okay if we're in a bear market then yes you know buy the rumor sell the news but you know it could be anyone's guess but at the same time what i would recommend is if you are going to sell your cardano you probably want to not sell all of it because you know it could just leave you behind and just carry on going up and you might be waiting for a dip that's never going to come potentially all right guys none of this is financial advice remember i'm just giving my opinion on this okay guys so i won't feel comfortable selling all of my cardano at that stage if that was the if that was the case another thing i want to zone in on that we can't forget is the price of bitcoin of course like playing ball okay guys because if bitcoin decides to dump that's going to drag you know uh cardano and a lot of the other altcoins down with it um it's just going to delay the process okay but it's still bullish obviously you know i do expect if we do see a big dip on cardano or anything like that it's going to get bought real quickly we've seen it happen we've seen it happen on the last dip okay guys um it just shows the demand for cardano and it's just becoming ever more bullish as each day goes by especially with this build up to the smart contracts okay guys so i am super bullish on cardano i do have a large bag of cardano i'm annoyed that my bag is not as big as it could have been because i could have been buying a lot more um a long time ago but you know it is what it is and uh, sometimes you sleep on a project that you shouldn't be sleeping on and you kind of um forget about it because cardano it did kind of take its time it did take uh, did take its time over the last few years in my opinion okay guys but it's redeemed itself in my opinion as well um it's definitely one one of the number one players for um you know in terms of outperforming uh, bitcoin and so on in the long term i think you're going to see huge gains out of cardano okay guys price prediction i don't normally do a price prediction but i won't be surprised if it did do another 10x um only based on the fact that bnb did 10x and and um you know i mean it's possible okay to see a 20 dollar cardano uh, that is not in the very short term but in the short in the, in the mid to long term i think it can definitely exceed that because with people talking about cardano go to 10 dollars and so on you know all it takes is fomo to kind of you know <laughs> um, make that go a lot higher okay guys so 10x would be a conservative um you know to say 100x would be you know absolutely crazy you know in the long term, who knows? The potential for it, if it's reaching you know, a multi-trillions in, in dollars of market cap, then that there's potential there. Okay, guys. So let me know in the comments what you think about what I said. Uh, do me a favor and subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you in the next one.